Hello and welcome. My name is Brian Diaz, AKA Active Nature Explorer. And I am My Brother's Keeper Peer Advocate with LA County Library. Today, I'd like to talk about LA County Library's new Nature Exploration Bags and how you can be a nature explorer in your own community. Nature Exploration Bags are a circulating kit that will be a permanent part of our library collections and will be available for checkout at five participating locations. The bags were developed in partnership with the Natural History Museum of Los Angeles County and sponsored by LA County Library Foundation and Edison International. They contain tools and tips to encourage the youth five and up, families and others, to explore nature and practice being scientists in their own communities. So anybody can be an explorer of all ages. Do you hear that? Nature is calling your name. Your nearest library may not be one of the five participating library locations, but don't worry, I'll be sharing some alternative items that can be found at home so you can still be a nature explorer. The items included in the nature exploration bag are Nature Exploration Messenger Bag. This holds our tools to go out and explore nature right outside our doors. Some substitutions that you can use are a backpack or a reusable grocery bag. Now the next item in our list is the magnifying glass. Use this to help you examine plants and animals up close. Now you can make your own magnifying glass with just a regular water bottle. And this is how you would use it. So you just use the top half of the water bottle and it'll work the same way as the magnifying glass. Next we have our plastic tubes with lids. Now you can use this to examine small items such as ladybugs, seeds, and pill bugs, but be sure to put them back where you found them. Some substitutions that you can use for this is any clear carryout container, or what I have here, a clear Tupperware. It works the same way. It has, you know, the container and the lid. You go ahead and put that on and close it off, and it's just as good as the original. Our next item in our nature exploration bag is our magnifying bug jar. Use this to observe small items in more detail by using the magnifying lid for a closer look. We can use our homemade magnifying glass and our clear carryout container to make our own magnifying bug jar. So we'll use it the same way. We'll put our small items to observe in our clear carryout and we'll use our magnifying glass to observe it in more detail. And it works just the same as the original. Our next item in our nature exploration bag is our nature exploration community journal. Use this to record what you see, hear, smell, and experience for the next participant to learn and to add to. Some sample journal entries can be something like this. On April 22nd, 2021 at 3.30 p.m., I looked at the green bushes on the west side of the library. The sprinklers had just gone off, so the soil was still wet. A worm crawled out from underneath the ground. It was about 2.5 inches long. What that worm has gone through, it's hard to say, but I knew one thing for sure, he has had it. The way he just crawled out screamed to me. What would he do next? I don't know, but one day he shall achieve his goal. I shall name thee Superworm the First, because there will be more. There always is. Now, some substitutions that you can use are an old notebook or some scratch sheets of paper. Our next item in our nature exploration bag is a ruler. Use this to help you learn the size of what you see by measuring it. You can make your own homemade ruler by borrowing one from your local library. Take a sheet of paper and measure out the measurements as I made one here. Now, the next items in our nature exploration bag is quite a handful. We have a pen, a pencil, an eraser, and some tape. Use these tools to write, draw pictures, or add fallen leaves or petals to our community journal. A rule all nature explorers must follow is to always be respectful of nature and to avoid picking up anything off living plants. You can use some of your school supplies that may be laying around your house to substitute for the items that are in the nature exploration bag. Our final item in our nature exploration bag is our bilingual nature exploration field guide. Now, I'm not an expert on nature quite yet, which is why this field guide covers more on how to be a nature explorer. Now I know what you're thinking. How do I get started? Where do I go? 
Don't fear Nature Explorer, I am here to help. I will be sharing some Nature Explorer tips that can also be found in your Nature Exploration Field Guide. The first tip is to go outside. Yep, it's that easy. You can find wildlife like plants, insects, or other creatures in your neighborhood, parks, schools, beaches, hiking trails, and more. Move quietly and slowly. To be even more observant, look down, up, and underneath. Think about habitats, the nature homes for animals and plants. Where would they go for food or for shelter? Being a nature explorer is a lot of fun, but we must remember to always be safe and to keep nature safe. Return insects, rocks, and small items to the original homes whenever possible. Nature exploration bags will be available for checkout at the following locations. San Fernando Library, Quartz Hill Library, South Whittier Library, Compton Library, and City Terrace Library. Nature exploration bags can be borrowed for three weeks and renewed up to three times. The bags are not available for holds. Some books that I recommend are Wild LA Explore the Amazing Nature in and Around Los Angeles by Natural History Museum of Los Angeles County. Nature Play at Home, Creating Outdoor Spaces that Connect Children with the Natural World by Nancy Strinista. Some useful websites and exploration activities that I recommend are explore.org, Observe nature through live nature camps and documentaries. Google Earth, explore over 30 national parks across the country with Google Earth virtual guided tours. And iNaturalist.org, record encounters with plants and wildlife and connect with experts to identify them. We hope you have enjoyed our introduction to our nature exploration bag. I hope I have inspired you to come down to our selective library so you can check out your nature exploration bag. Click the link in the description box for our survey and upcoming programs. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell for easy access to our new videos. Until our nature path crosses once again, keep on exploring!